Well, hello, boys and girls. It's when I feel like at a clock, and we haven't been together for a long, long time. I tried my hand at some game takes, uh, uh, game takes app, and uh, didn't. It was an American uh, app, and uh, they didn't take well to hockey, which is really weird. Uh, so I'm back onto the YouTube again. Um, my name is. My NHL, my my name is Pearl of Wisdom, and you're listening to my NHL Pearls of Wisdom. As you can see, I'm just using my phone. I'm a little disheveled right now. Um, I'm waiting for the massage girls to come for uh, my first uh, massage of the day. But um, I woke up to find out that Joel Quinville has been fired. Um, to me, that is absolutely insane. Um, Joel Quinville, probably top three, four, maybe four coaches in the league right now or ever as far as this generation or since he started coaching. You've got uh, Babcock, Trotz, um, and probably Q. Uh, you got guys coming up or Gallant. You could put Gallant in there, but he's got a lot to prove yet. Um, I think Travis Green in Vancouver is probably going to reach these levels. But besides that, uh, you know, Maurice is probably uh, just a little bit below. Um, off the, I'm just going off the top of my head here. Those are pretty much the top three coaches in the league. Chicago just fired one of the top three coaches in the league. Now, oh, um, you know, remember that um, if you go back into your books, boys and girls, uh, just if you go back to, I think it's like uh, um, September 13th last year, something like that, I uh, talked about how I was very against the uh, Julian firing in Boston as well. And that has turned out not too bad. Cassidy was a great, is a great coach. Um, he's doing fairly well with that. But look what Julian now is doing in Montreal. I never thought the coach was a problem there. Um, and as it turns out, what happened there was a lot of people give Julian, oh, he's this defensive coach and, uh, you know, he, they needed to open it up or whatever. But guess what? Julian was wanting to open it up and that actually was more the reason why he got fired um, apparently this is what I heard but if you look at Montreal look what he's doing there he's opened it right up there in Montreal so there could be some uh, it could be some truth to that but as far as Quindle is concerned now you are looking I mean half the league right now at least half and like I said, I just opened my eyes and started doing this video. So I don't have any, I can't go, but off the top of my head, uh, LA is probably kicking themselves <laughs> that they, that, you know, they brought in an intern. Although I think De Willie Desjardins, I wanted, didn't want to, I wanted to do a video on that. He did much better in Vancouver than he was, than, but if you've got green on the back burner, I guess I can see why you fire Willie Desjardins but um, he could he could make he could make a, a go of it there in LA but are you gonna go with Willie Desjardins if Q is available I mean just before he gets fired you do what you do and now you can't flip-flop on Desjardins can you I don't think so but um, you know Bruce Bruce Boudreaux in Minnesota probably is safe I mean, I could also put him up there as, you know, in the top six or seven coaches in the league. Um, uh, where Florida, Florida, you know, could Florida could be looking at possibly making a flip there with uh, Bugner. Uh, you know, Buffalo already just signed. Uh, Housley is going to be fine in, in Buffalo, so I, I don't put them there. But Ottawa with Boucher, possibly. Uh, San Jose, DeBoer, possibly. I mean, uh, teams that are underachieving right now in St. Louis with Yo, there's a very good possibility. Although I think Yo is a good coach. It has nothing to do with coaching there. It has to do with really bad goaltending, um, which I just did a, a pod on that not too long ago. Great coaches can make goaltenders better. 
but good coaches are killed by bad goaltending. And that's what you're seeing in, like, there's another one, Philadelphia. Philadelphia, you could say, um, Hackstall, okay, let's let's bring in Q. I mean, I would, honestly. Uh, not that there's anything really horrible about Hackstall, but, I mean, if you can have Q, jeez. Um, oh, another one in the top five guys. Jesus, I'm bringing up a lot of top five guys is Tortorella in Columbus. But Columbus is struggling. You might look at doing something like that. But Haxel's not a bad coach, but he's got the, they've got really bad goaltending. St. Louis isn't a bad – Yo is not a bad coach, but he's got really bad goaltending. But a guy like Hugh can bring out – can even make good – goaltenders better and like trots that's the sign of a really damn good coach like top of the league coach coaches that seem to be able to take make goaltenders actually better trots is definitely one of those babcock seems to be able to do that um q seems to do that so if i'm a an owner or a general manager out there right now i am really going like this about my goal coaching situation because quick Q is fantastic. Q is an amazing coach. I think Chicago is just I think it's terrible that they would fire uh, a guy at the a coach at this level. There's when when you have a great goal I'm not like with the analytics group on this. I think coaching is extremely important in the NHL. And if you've got somebody like Q, I'm not I don't want to let him go. I just I I couldn't I couldn't let him go. As a maybe a general manager as a general manager Bowman is, uh you know afraid of his own job and this gives him some time. But I don't know I I don't even think that Bowman needs to worry about his job there. Anyways, boys and girls, that's my full forty two percent. That's all I have to give. Oh by the way, I didn't bring any. I don't have any with me. Jaime's body lube. It's the best there. I said it, and you can get yourself. A vat of Jaime's Body Lube and a My NHL Pearls of Wisdom necklace. If you just hit that little subscribe button or maybe give me a like or a comment, helicopter to your door and sign by me. Who wouldn't want that? Have a great day and lots of love to you.